So hello everyone, welcome to 25 Days of Black Friday's Challenge. For the next 25 days, you are going to get a new business question for you to solve. Well, you will go to curva.com 25 Days of Tax Fridays Challenge, link down below, and then you will get to this page. In here you have a Power BI report that is embedded, just full screen, and every day a new tile will open and will give you the question that you need to answer. Today is day one. The question is, how many current products cost less than $20? For each new day, a new tile will open with a new question. Yes, you do get the answer to the question. Here's the thing. You have one day to solve each challenge. So if you click on the tile at the moment, it's going to tell you that you have to get back here in one day to get the answer. But once the day has passed, when you click, you will get the answer and also you will get a link to a video that it will explain how I solved the, the challenge, okay? Well, I have used the modified version of the Northwind dataset, right? So you need to get my version. Let me go back here. If you go scroll down a little bit, you will see here this file. If you click in here, you will get a zip file and there you have my version of the Northwind. Make sure you refresh it every day, okay? Because I've made the Northwind dataset a live company. Here's the thing, I have tried to create a variety of questions that you will probably come across doing business reporting. Week one is mainly about products, week two orders, week three customers, week four we have stock and week five we have employees. How difficult are the DAX questions? Can I solve them as a beginner? Well, I have tried my best to make sure that anyone can participate. So you will be able to solve the challenge with more or less sophisticated DAX. So if you are a beginner, don't worry, you will be able to participate. You don't need to be a master in DAX. If you are an experienced DAX user, this challenge is for you to make sure that you return the answers in a card as I had to do it that gives a little bit adds a little bit of complexity to the challenge and uh, try to make it as performance as you want. So you've got the answer, great. You have the possibility to tweet it using 25 days of tax Fridays tag or a curveball tag so I know that you've done it and you need to do it within the day of the challenge, okay? Now, also, if you're going to check the solution video, make sure that you give us also your DAX. I would love to see how people do the same thing with different DAX. Oh my God, I've just seen this and it's day 13. Can I get started? Absolutely, it's never too late to get started. You can either start by day one and continue, or you can start by the day you're at and wait every day for the new challenges to come. Either way, you are going to learn at home, guaranteed. Do you have any questions? Is there something wrong? Is there any link wrong? Please let me know. I've done my best to make sure that everything is working, but it's 25 things of everything. So if there's a link that is wrong or there's something that is weird, just let me know, tweet me, put it in the comments on YouTube, put it here in the comments on the website. You know, there's a lot of ways to reach me. So as you can see, it is day one. Make sure that you get this file here, go up, get your question, how many current products cost less than $20? And if you get stuck, come back here tomorrow for the answer and a new question. Okay, enjoy the challenge. Fingers crossed that you enjoy this. It's been tough, tough work. But uh, I will see you again after the new year. I've done videos enough for this lifetime, probably. <laughs> Take care. Bye.